Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If you aren't importing a company file or company file data after signing up for QuickBooks Online, then you must create and customize a new company file. After signing up for a free trial or buying a new company file subscription, a Get Started wizard appears and provides an overview of this process. Read the information and click the Next button to continue. In the next screen, enter your business name. If this is your legal business name, check the This is my legal business name checkbox. Then click the Next button to continue. The next screen asks how you have been managing your finances. Select the button for your answer and then click Next to continue. If you want to import data from QuickBooks Desktop or Sage 50 or Peachtree, then follow the instructions shown on screen to learn how to find up-to-date instructions about importing company data from your version of QuickBooks Desktop or Sage 50 or Peachtree. Alternatively, to create a new company file instead of importing data, simply continue to answer the questions posed to you in each screen of the Get Started wizard and click the Next button to continue through the screens. You can also click the Back button if needed to go back and change answers. Many screens also have a Skip link that you can click to skip optional steps if desired. When finished, QuickBooks then opens the dashboard page for your new company file. It also provides a tour of the program's interface you can view if desired. Depending on your setup choices, a setup checklist widget that contains a list of initial tasks you can do to finish the setup and customize your company file before you start using it may appear within your dashboard page. You can click the links to step through the actions in the setup checklist if desired. To minimize the setup checklist if shown, click the triple dot button in its upper right corner and then select the minimize checklist command. To show the setup checklist if minimized, click the triple dot button in its upper right corner and then select the show checklist command. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.